Good morning, brothers and sisters. I welcome you to our daily devotion insight. And this morning, the title of our devotion is called What Do You Do? Uh, I will read the scripture from the book of John, chapter 15, verse 8. It goes like this By this, my Father is glorified that you bear much fruit, so that you will be my disciples. Just imagine you join a group of uh, a party uh, where a large group of them is people that you don't know. And how would you initiate a conversation with the person that you're about to meet or the strangers that you're about to meet? Usually you will ask them, of course, with some pleasantries, how are you, how are you doing? And the follow-up question is, what do you do, isn't it? And then the person will say, uh, oh, yeah, I do this, I do that. And of course, the, this person will ask you the same question again. And, uh, and you will say, I will do this and do that. And this will buy you some time, you know, and sort of break the ice. And, and this conversation usually will lead to somewhere, isn't it? So this question, what do you do? Then perhaps we as Christians, we can actually answer like this. I, I serve the Lord Jesus Christ by working as someone, as a fireman or as a businessman. I serve the Lord Jesus Christ as an architect or as a doctor, right? And when we really look into it, uh, as a Christian, really, our only goal in life is to serve Him, isn't it? Uh, we might go many different venues for our vocation, but ultimately, we are working for Him. Don't you agree? As Christ came into the world to accomplish the Father's will, so we go into the world to accomplish Christ's will. So when we work for the Lord, we accomplish two things. We earning our daily bread to our labor and extending God's kingdom by manifesting Christ's love and value to others. When we have this mentality, whatever we do, whichever position you are in, your life will be more meaningful because you are no longer working for money. You are no longer working to pay your debt, to pay uh, the house loan or the car loan or, or to, to sustain your lifestyle. I work because I want to honor God and I'm extending God's kingdom through my vocation because why? I'm a servant of God. And through this, the Bible says, my Father is glorified as we bear fruit for we are and we will be his disciples. So when we go to our work this morning, knowing that you are not working for yourselves, you are working for the Lord and we serve our God through our various vocation in this world. May the word of the Lord bless you this morning.